friends in this video we are going to see two examples which will be either terminating or non terminating but repeating so let's see how to check that so here as we can see the rational number is 64 upon 455 so the first step is to write down the numerator and denominator in its prime factor form it is very important why because only then the denominator will help us in determining whether it is uh, terminating or non-terminating but repeating type of nature of the particular rational number. So here let's first prime factorize 64. So 64 can be written as 8 8 is 64, 8 when further split in the form of 2 it is, it can be 2 to the power 6 when we find out the prime factors using the 8th standard method we get 2 to the power 6 that means when 2 is multiplied 6 times we get 64 likewise when we prime factorize 455 the prime factors which we get are 5 into 7 into 13 now if I take another rational number let us uh, say it is 15 upon 1600 so here again my step would be to write it in the prime factor form so 15 can be written as 3 into 5 these are prime factors upon the denominator will be 2 to the power 6 into 5 square you can uh, find manually the prime factors of 1600 using that method which we have learned in junior classes 1600 that's 2 8 16 then 0 0 like that even this way you can find out the factors you will get it this way also if you see the prime factors which we get is 5 square 1 2 3 4 5 6 to the power 6 so this is how 1600 can be written now the important thing to be checked here is the denominator for each rational number here the denominator is 5 into 7 into 13 here the denominator is having the base 2 and 5 only so the main thing is this always keep in mind 2 to the power m into 5 to the power n this plays very very important role in determining any rational number is terminating or non-terminating but repeating if the denominator is in this form only then it is terminating otherwise it is non-terminating but repeating so here as we can say that uh, see that the denominator is only having 2 and 5 as the base which is the required condition for terminating so we can say that 15 upon 1600 is terminating in nature this rational number is terminating that means its decimal expansion will terminate but here unlike if we see 7 is the extra number extra a new prime number which we see when compared to the required condition or the condition which is to be fulfilled no other number than 2 and 5 should be there in the denominator after the cancellation of any common factor in numerator and denominator so here already it is in reduced form there is nothing which can be cancelled like right 7 cannot be cancelled from the denominator in this case 7 remains here which is uh, which is which should not be there because it contains only 2 and 5 so since it has 7 in the denominator it will be non terminating it will be non terminating but repeating in nature but repeating in nature so this is how we check any rational number is terminating or non-terminating but repeating thank you